Yo, Jamie Bond from DotLotion.com and Backcountry Junkie. Since the winter trade shows are happening this week, I thought what better time to review a new jacket from Mountain Hardware coming out in fall 2012, the Alakazam jacket. Not sure why it's called that, but we're just going to go with it. One of Mountain Hardware's lighter weight jackets, really good for alpine climbing, skiing, that sort of thing. Um, it's all dry to elite, so waterproof and super, super breathable. You can pretty much do whatever the hell you want in it, and you probably won't work up too much of a sweat. Uh, got some nice, flexible, even more breathable panels where you need some extra movement, you know, just in case you're doing some ice climbing or maybe just busting out some rap maneuvers on the hill, maybe doing the worm, a little bit of on snow break dancing, it's got you covered. Got all sorts of good pockets, some nice big hip pockets, some chest pockets, a little wallet pocket inside, secret sleeve pocket, pit zips, gotta have the pit zips for those stinky days. Got the good old thumb loop for when you wanna wear gloves that don't wrap around your jacket. Nice big cuff for when you do wanna wear gloves that go under your jacket, and who doesn't apart from heli ski guides who think that they're cool. It's got this funky tapered wrist feature. I have no idea what that's for, but looks like they were thinking of it, so. They put some effort into this jacket. Like other mountain hardware jackets, it seems to fit a little bit on the slim side. So if you really want to show off how skinny you really are, then buy a small size. And if you want to look a little bit more gangsta, then buy a bigger size. Oh, it's got a really big hood, which is awesome. If you like skiing uh, with your hood over your helmet, nice big cuff. It doesn't strangle you when you're wearing layers, so that's a bonus. Yeah, all in all, I think it's going to be a pretty awesome warm day and spring touring jacket. You know, it is waterproof and it is windproof, but it's just so breathable that it kind of just feels like you're, uh, you know, out in a soft shell. So uh, just keep that in mind. Uh, this jacket's probably best suited for spring touring. Not exactly the kind of jacket I'd bring to the Arctic, but uh, I'm not in the Arctic. So we're good.